charged 20 micro coulomb is placed on the positive plate of an isolated parallel plate capacitor capacitance 10 microfarad calculate the potential difference developed between the plates now let's say i have this is my first plate and this is my second plate now 20 micro coulomb charge is given to let's say this plate 20 micro coulomb and this is having no charge that is zero charge now let's say i'll take a point here and uh, the electric field between the two parallel plates or electric field due to one plate is given by E is equal to sigma divided by 2 epsilon this is the electric field due to one plate now let's say this is charged so there will be an electric field in this direction of course and uh, the electric field will be of magnitude sigma upon 2 epsilon and electric field due to this plate will be zero as the charge on this surface is zero so we have electric field given by sigma upon 2 epsilon naught electric field as we know is v by d so we write v by d is equal to sigma divided by 2 epsilon naught this sigma can be written as q by a to 2 epsilon naught because this sigma is nothing but the charge density or the surface charge density of the plate so sigma is q by a, that is the surface charge density so i can rearrange it as v into epsilon naught into area to upon my d divided by q by 2 so we have v into c is equal to q by 2 because capacitance is given by epsilon naught a by d this will be so on substituting the value we have V is equal to Q the Q value is given by 20 micro coulomb 20 minus 6 coulomb divided by 2 divided by capacitance that is 10 into 10 to the minus 6 value which comes out to be 1 volt that is the answer